Florida boaters missing after anchor mishap on lake, sheriff says. Jeffrey Marrero, 34, and Orlando Ortiz, 32, presumed drowned on Lake Eloise in Winter Haven, Florida. Two boaters in Florida are missing in a possible double drowning after a mishap with the vessel's anchor while sailing on the choppy waters of a lake over the weekend, authorities said. Jeffrey Marrero, 34, and Orlando Ortiz, 32, remain missing after jumping into the water of Lake Eloise near the Legoland theme park in Winter Haven to rescue Ortiz's girlfriend, 38-year-old Velky Velasquez, the Polk County Sheriff's Office said. The couple rented a 16-foot Tahoe ski boat to celebrate their one-year anniversary with Marrero and his two daughters, ages 10 and 8, the sheriff's office said. They had to take a class to rent the boat, and they successfully took the class, Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd told reporters. Miami Beach implements midnight curfew for spring breakers after two fatal shootings. However, the problems began when Velasquez jumped into the water with the anchor, according to Judd, who said the lake was rough with 20 miles per hour winds and some whitecaps. She's just very inexperienced, so she thinks that you have to get into the water, put the anchor in and then tie it to the boat, the sheriff said. As Velasquez was in the water, officials said the boat began to float away and the two men jumped in to help her. However, the men were not strong swimmers and wound up going underwater. Rescue video captures Florida man saved from flooded Southwest Canyon, two friends killed identified. Marrero's 10-year-old daughter called 911 from the boat. Deputies and a good Samaritan sailed to the girl's location and safely brought them to shore. Deputies also rescued Velasquez, who was found treading water a distance away from the boat. Judd said the search will continue for the missing men using sonar and underwater drones until they are found. We don't allow anyone's loved one to stay in the lake. We will find them, Judd said.